What's up, fish lovers? It's Wednesday, and that means we're gonna do a species spotlight. Today's species loves sand, loves to burrow, is absolutely gorgeous, and a lot of fun. This species is the blue spotted jawfish. The blue dot or blue spotted jawfish is an elongated fish with a large head, bulbous eyes, an enormous mouth, and an exceptional personality. Their coloration spans from dusky yellow to bright orange and vibrant yellow near the head, and their bodies are covered in iridescent blue spots. These fish are found living in colonies of about 40 feet depth in the Pacific Ocean. Many of the fish found in the aquarium hobby in the U.S. are sourced from Mexico. As a sight feeder, blue spot jawfish are active during the day and rest in their burrow at night. Feed your pet standard carnivore fare, such as thawed frozen foods like mysis or chopped mixture. Some may also accept pellets. In larger tanks, make sure the food passes by the burrow, as some will only venture so far. A healthy habitat will have at least three inches of substrate to burrow. In a quarantine tank, you can cut PVC pipes into little tubes to add some shelter for them to help them feel secure. This fish prefers standard aquarium temperatures of 72 to 78 degrees, maybe just a tad cooler than some of the warmer reef aquariums, and standard salinity ranges from 1.02 to 1.025, and typical pHs from 8 to 8.4 will suffice. So do you want a blue spot jawfish? Here are some things to think of. This fish requires an established and successful saltwater aquarium, so make sure you have some experience in the hobby and that your tank's set up, cycled, and ready to go. Second, of course they need sand. Third, this tank is a super jumper, so make sure that the top of your tank is sealed, and also be careful with that quarantine tank. You'll need about $70 to $120 to acquire this fish, so it is a pretty expensive fish, and there's other jawfish you can pursue if that's out of your price range. But overall, people love this fish. The blue spotted jawfish is almost puppy dog-like. It has a large personality. They try to play tough and open their mouths to scare other fish when they come near their burrow. But overall, I've never had too many problems with aggression. Another cool thing is they're compatible in seahorse tanks. And they're kind of a good species to have since they inhabit a different type of the environment in that sort of aquarium. So thank you very much for watching this video. I hope you got some interesting information about blue spotted jawfish. Uh, let me know if you've had one and what your experiences have been in the comments section below. I'd also like to acknowledge the Kansas City Sea Life Aquarium, uh, which is where I actually took the video of this fish in their display. And that's it. So thank you very much for watching Puff Daddy Reef. I'll see you Saturday. Missing someone Missing someone